Hey, Dad, look what happened to that praying mantis's bottom. All right, buddy, what are we going to talk about today? A praying mantis. All right, what type of praying mantis? Carolina. Because we, we just did an episode yeah. on the Chinese praying mantis. Mm -hmm. Now we're going to talk about the Carolina praying mantis. And real fast, we're going we're gonna to talk about the difference, but the Carolina praying mantis, is it invasive or is it native? Native. All right, but you know what? Okay. You have two, yes. right? One's a male one's and one's a female. A female. So first, we're going to talk about the female, mm -hmm. all right, which is the one that you caught, mm -hmm. what, two days ago, I think? Yeah. All it right. Was there. It was sitting on these plants. All right. Hey, listen. What was the plan? What? What were we originally planning to do? To feed the female and uh, have them mate. Yeah, we were going to feed her, right? Yeah. Because what happened? Right before they mated. it. So what? That, what ha yeah. Um, she doesn't eat them. Because what happened last year when we did this? <laughs> right, we we they we made it them, it's, and it was successful, right? I because mean, what's this right here? Egg sac. That's the okuth, right? That's yeah. the egg sac. So we were successful that in mating them. Mated. That probably is their egg sac. That's right. All right. So we were going to mate them. We had the cage set up downstairs. The female was in there. We had food for her. Right, we were going to get, we were gonna put them together and mate them, and then let's take. Can you open up the cage? I'm not. I'm not. All right, I will open up the cage, and then we'll talk a little bit about why they're that not. Side. Yeah. Oh, it's this set. Okay. So first off, this is the female, right? And how do we? How did we know it was a female? Do you remember? It can't fly. <laughs> well, it can't fly. It's got wings, but yeah. it couldn't fly. Its uh, back end is much thicker, bigger than the male, mm -hmm. right? But if you look closely, this one's back end is, what color is that? Brown and split. Black, egg. yeah, so we're going to talk a little bit about this. So it's black and brown, right? Mm -hmm. And what, yesterday night, last night, we noticed that the very tip of her abdomen, where the, the CC, I think is how yeah. you pronounce it is, that it started turning dark black, right? It's it, I didn't notice that. Yeah, it, it started turning. I, I noticed it turning like, uh like a brownish color okay well it was a br yeah it started with brown and it started turning black and it slowly went from the tip of the abdomen all the way up behind the black behind the, the back legs right and at first we thought maybe it was molting yeah. we didn't really know we well we kind of had an idea that it could be a parasite when, right when we found it its abdomen was when we found it right there its abdomen was so big in the last female we found, it admin was not that big. So I think I know why. Yeah. Well, let's get to it's that. In so big. Hold on. We'll get to that in just a second, okay? So I'm going to... Um, can you open up the door, please? Okay. Oh, this? Yeah, yeah just... I don't want to do it. I'm scared. Uh, well, it's fine. All right, let's just hold that door open and turn this here this way. So here, hold it. It's not going to hurt you. All right, so we are going to... We're going to see if I can zoom in. All right, so we thought it was either molting or what? Uh, what else could it could have caused it? Or getting ready to mate or something. No, we, we knew it wasn't mating. Yeah. We said, okay, it's either molting or it has a parasite, Salt. right? And there's two types of parasites. parasites that these guys can get. Do you remember what types of parasites they are? A hairworm. Uh-huh, a hairworm. And what does a hairworm do? It, can, it goes into their booty butt. So, yeah, so a hair worm... And that it controls their mind. Uh-huh. And it brings them to water. Uh-huh. And then it comes out in the water. It comes out, from yeah. From the booty butt. So it, 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 it... And that doesn't really kill them. And it also does that to crickets, but it doesn't kill them. Correct. So a hair worm will get into a... It's basically like an intestinal... Uh, like what, what we would... What humans sometimes can have as far as worms in their intestines. But this uh, hair worm will actually, like you said, it goes in... And it can actually um, make the insects do things, right? Like go to water, right? So that's a hairworm. What's the other 
Uh, do you uh, remember what the other one was, the other parasite? No. Uh, it's basically, um, uh... I'm pretty sure it's that parasite, because that does not look like a harem. It it's does not too, look like a harem. It's way too fat. So let's see, let's <laughs> see, are so hold on. Skinny. I could, I could, we could see it wiggling around, right? Mm -hmm. So what has happened, well, you tell me, what's happened here? What has happened it's with its split, butt? It's split open. So what's going to happen to this praying mantis? It's going to die, right? I'm mad. I'm mad. We're not going to be able to uh, mate this praying mantis, Unless right? Unless we find another one. Well, we'll see. We'll see if we can find another one. But unfortunately, this praying mantis is going to die, mm -hmm. right? What? Which is, you know, unfortunate, mm -hmm. but that's nature, right? All right. So can we go ahead and... Um, here you I know you don't want to touch it. So you got to take the camera Take the camera You got it. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna I'm gonna come over here. I'm gonna let her this is where we found her, right? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna let her go back no, on out this here. Plant. Well, I'm that's fine. I'm just gonna let her go right here, and then we got to get the Is she out? She, She's still alive. I, I mean for all I know there could be multiple mm -hmm. She doesn't want to let go Stop. Yeah, just poke her with that stick and get her out. Yeah, well, I'm trying Be to. Be careful so that you don't get bit by the parasite. I'm not, the parasite's not going to bite me. Okay. okay. And then she goes. Is she out? Okay, she's she, out. She's upside down. All right, we moved her out of the cage, and there's still worms coming out of her butt. I know. There's like two more. Yeah, we saw two more come out. So there's multiple. There's another one. Hold on. There's another one right there coming out. Oh my god. Ew. Yeah, that is. That is gross. That, that is no, disgusting. I'm, I'm away. All right. So, <laughs> so, unfortunately, she's not gonna make it, is she? Huh? There's no chance. There's there is no chance that. Zero. She's unfortunately there is she's gonna die. There is zero percent of her living. Zero so we're gonna have to we're we're gonna do some research and we'll see what kind of parasite this possibly could be. Yeah, okay. Also All right, Brody. We think we know what happened, right? Mm -hmm. So we did some investigative work. We looked it up. What do you think parasited, or what was the parasite that was in this praying mantis? Mazifia. 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 I. I mean. Mm -hmm. It's, I think it's Latin, I don't know. I can't pronounce it. But what is it? Do you remember what it is? A well, yes, it was a parasite, but, <laughs> but what was it? What is a it? Fly. It's Larvae. a fly. And how big is the fly? It's what? about the size of a housefly. It's about the size of a housefly, right? Mm -hmm. So what happens? How, does the, how did the parasites get inside the praying mantis? So what, the, what they do? They land on the praying mantis. Mm -hmm. Flies land on the praying mantis. Then inject their eggs into the praying mantis. Mm -hmm. Then the larvae. This is kind of gross. Um, the larvae eat all the blood. Well, drink well they them. don't drink. Yeah, they, they don't drink. eat all the blood. But well, yeah, eat mo drink most of it, like a vampire. <laughs> yep. So the so it the should be called a vampire fly. Yeah. So the flies land on the praying mantis mm -hmm. up near where their arms mm -hmm. are. They inject their eggs into the praying mantis. The eggs stay inside. They hatch, mm -hmm. and then their really tiny larvae come out, and they grow inside the praying mantis, feeding off of the blood. Now here's the cool thing: the the praying the uh, larvae because they're feeding off the blood it causes the mantises not to grow as big as mm -hmm. they would have if they weren't normally a parasite, didn't have parasites, right? Because mm -hmm. the parasites are taking nutrients away. So the larvae stay inside the praying mantis and they grow and eventually they get too big. So they work their way down into the abdomen. Daddy, something's happening right there in that room. Yeah, hold on. Uh, it's just the wind blowing, buddy. Um, so they, they move their way down into the abdomen and they bust out, which is what we saw. 
Now, how many larvae did we see crawl out of this praying mantis? Three or five. Three or four or five. Yeah, somewhere between three and five is what we saw, right? Now, occasionally praying mantises can survive this, mm -hmm. right? Is this is the praying mantis going to be able to uh, procreate, have no. babies? No. I mean, this praying mantis, because it had so many larvae in it, I don't think it's going to survive. It looks yeah. like it's in pretty sh rough shape, doesn't it? I think it? it's a zero chance for it to survive. Okay. So originally we were going to originally we were going to talk about the male praying mantises yeah. that we have and the difference between the Chinese and um, the um, yeah. Carolina. We're going to do that on a different video because yeah. this has gotten this was way bigger than we thought. We did yeah. not realize this was going to happen yeah, when we did this. Yeah, we did not realize. <laughs> All right. So what do you want to say to everybody? Thanks for watching. Make every day an adventure. Bye, guys.